Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you how to resize the taskbar in Windows 10. This will be an easy tutorial and I will be showing you the step-by-step -step process for resizing the taskbar. Let's get right to it. The easiest way to do it is this, okay? You have to bring your cursor and hover it uh, basically right between the desktop wallpaper and the taskbar and there should be two arrows that appear and if you look on mine there aren't two arrows that appear and this is a very common issue so the way to fix it is this you're gonna go and bring your mouse over the taskbar where there isn't an icon so not over here you're gonna bring it over here and then you're gonna right click and if you see it says lock the taskbar now mine is checked and that is the reason that mine is not you know allowing me to move my taskbar and resize it I'm going to uncheck this by clicking on it just like that. Now, if you take a look, if I bring the mouse between the desktop wallpaper and the uh, taskbar, you'll see these arrows right here. Now, what I can do is I can just left click and drag up or down. Um, you know, when the taskbar is, is bigger, I can drag down um, to resize it. So I'm going to left click and I can just drag up to make the taskbar bigger, just like that. Or I can left click and then drag down to make the taskbar smaller. That's it. And when you have it in the position that you want, if you want to lock it into place, all that you have to do is right click on the taskbar again, and then click lock the taskbar to make sure that you check it off. Just like that. And now the taskbar is locked into place and I can't move it anymore. That's it. Once again, let's say I wanted to make it bigger and lock it. I would just uncheck that. I would make it you know a little bit bigger let's say i wanted it to be that big then i would right click and i would lock the taskbar in place and now i can't move it anymore that's it it's a very simple process and in this video i've shown you exactly how to do it and i hope that you have enjoyed this tutorial and that's all i have for you today thanks for watching